You can yeah. see my nails. <laughs> you can definitely see my nails. So, hello everybody. Welcome to Mika's Marketing Mind. Okay. Of course, I am in Danan. I am at Hoa's apartment. She's my friend and she does amazing nail art work. And uh, I'm a volunteer today. So Hi. what are we going to do? Uh, I think we will do something quite simple because you're a really nice lady and... <laughs> <laughs> so, what's the story behind this nail art for you? My mother, she keeps telling me that you have to do this. You have to learn about nail, take a course about nail art so that you can earn money easily. So your mother forced you a bit yeah. to learn how to create these um, nail art pieces. But later I just get really, really passionate and crazy about doing nails. And I think that nail art is the nails, doing nails, you not just doing nails, it's a kind of art. So uh -huh. yeah. Which color do you want? That is so beautiful! Do you think passion is important in a business, as a business owner? Yes, I think that everything we do, it should start from passion and love. For example, if you do for money, one day you will be exhausted from all the people you met, all of the pressure you have to handle because you do it just for the money. Even when you don't have passion, just keep looking at it, just, just try everything, like try skating, try swimming, try playing guitar or doing other stuff. So your advice to our viewers yes. about businesses and about entrepreneurial skills is if you don't know who you want to become in life or what you want to do professionally in life, just go out and try as many things as possible and one day you will find what you really like to do, what you can be passionate about. Yeah. I also didn't know that I would be passionate about Vietnam and living in Vietnam. Vietnam just happened to me. One moment I was not passionate about Vietnam because I didn't know Vietnam. And the other moment, I arrived in my first Dutch destination, which was Phu Quoc in the south. And I fell in love with the vibe, the atmosphere, the incredibly friendly Vietnamese people. And believe it or not, two weeks later, I started a job in Phu Quoc and I never left. So you also dream of starting up your own business, huh? Yeah, maybe someday in my 30s or so. Why is that that so many, many, many Vietnamese young people dream of having their own business? Probably because they just like me, they want something that gives them the feeling of freedom and doing what they like. And it's very easy to open a business in Vietnam compared to other countries like America or Australia. I love this amazing entrepreneurial atmosphere in Vietnam. It's one of the first things that I noticed. I mean, everywhere there are businesses, there are people working. It never stops. It's seven on seven. It's for, uh, 24 hours a day. And I also think that the government, they, they really encourage young people to, to open up their own business, to um, you know, develop their country develop the economy, even if in Da Nang or in Hue, in, especially in Ho Chi Minh City, there are so many programs that young people can find to help them start out their business. That's great! So beautiful, right? You give me the feeling that I'm very special, thank mm -hmm. you. It's amazing for me, as a Western person, to live in Vietnam and to meet so many young Vietnamese people who want to start up a business, who um, are studying so hard to become anything they want. Most of the time they want to have their own business. 
and with Mika's marketing mind, my big dream is to share all my marketing knowledge and all my experience um, in having worked for many businesses um, with all these people. He has a great passion about Vietnam and Vietnamese people and I wish that someday your channel will be become very popular to Vietnamese people and they, the young people, young Vietnamese can watch your videos and feel proud about their country and you know find their own passion or grow themselves. Very yeah. nice of you. Well, then you decide to move from a very, very good position in Belgium to Vietnam and start all over again. Very difficult, right? It's very difficult, but I've never been more happy. These are my stunningly beautiful nails, completely handmade if that is a good word if you want to have this magic artwork on your nails just send her a message i will add her contact details in the text down below the video and i will tag her on facebook and instagram we're almost at the end of this video i want to thank hoa for giving me these magical nails. I want to thank you, of course, for watching Mika's Marketing Mind. Stay tuned, subscribe via the button down below this video. The good news is I'm going to make more videos like this because each one of us has a beautiful story to share. And I'm incredibly interested in these Vietnamese stories because I love your country. Thank you. See you soon. Hen Gam Lai. Bye. <laughs>